be. Eyes open. Gotta find out where Hironobu's keeping the relic. Oh, you wow. You look like a cut of fuckable meat, are you? Evelyn. She. I felt her fear. Sure got it under control quick, too. I said no. They'll have my head for this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Finish. We shall see soon enough. My father is a tired, visionless old gray beard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality, stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye with its existence. I need a minute to finish. The thing here. Right, grab the heat sig. Matches the spec in the docks. Yorinobu's got the case here, guaranteed. Mm-hmm, we got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. Ooh, that took me a while, but yeah, I guess we found it. That robot guy looks really scary. Well, they are robot people. Yep, that'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. We nice got Nice work it. today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash on your data. You were never here. You were never here. You don't know me. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. Portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. Relax, I got it all under control. You fuck up and they come knocking on my door. Judy, relax. That's not gonna happen. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, city will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. V, one sec. Let's walk. I mean, <laughs> I thought that's what we we're gonna do. Well, what do you think? Well, what do you think? I think I see how you know so much about Yorinobu. It's simple. Men like Pillow talk a bit too much. So it's just about the sex? Biz. And biz only. So, what now? V. Do this job for me. I mean me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. 
No fucking way. Dex took a leap with me. He trusts me. Now I'm doing the same. 50%. With cred like that in your account, you won't need Dex for anything. No, Evelyn. It's not just about the money. I thought you were a merc. I thought it was always about the money. Not behind the back of someone who trusts me. Sorry. Fine. I never asked. But V? Hmm? I just hope you're as good as you are naive. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Good luck. Now go. I need a few words with Judy. Can't go behind Dex's back. <laughs> well. How things looking, Mr. V? Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. Beautiful. T Bug already called. How much? Said she's working her magic. We're all set. Dance Ready to go. Breaks. What now? Mm. Oh. Now we oh, do the I'm job I hired you to do. Grabbing that bio chip. We'll talk about the rest at the afterlife. See you there. Great. Yeah, about time, Holmes. What's new with Senora Wells? Uh, you know, she's worried about me. <laughs> Whatever. Can't help herself, you know? Checking to see if I'm not rotting in some dumpster, like most of the Wells boys. It's really starting to wear on me. The more I tell her everything's okay, or I feel like I'm straight up lying. But that's done after tomorrow. After life, here we come, baby. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Funny. What? For a club with the hottest contracts in town. Doesn't look like all it's bigged up to be. It's what's inside that counts, Joel. Ready to get your jerry popped? Freaking yeah, alarm just come went on. on. Jeez. This place used to be a morgue. You believe that? Who would have thunk? I know, right? Way before our time, that. <laughs> That's probably, probably why he called it the afterlife. The thing. And who might you clown? Name's V. This is Jackie Wells. Oh. Is that supposed to sound familiar? It will soon. We're here to see Dex. Yo, Dex. Got two live ones saying they're here to see you. Yeah? Alright then. Says he needs a second or two. Go get yourselves drinks or something. Way ahead of you, viejo. Night City. That's it right there. Beating. Hear it? Can you imagine? Susan Forrest, <laughs> Boa Boa, maybe even Morgan Blackhand. All sat on those. Fell asleep on that. I'm gonna say it right now. I probably should have read the lore a little bit, or watched some videos on it. Looks like we're up. All those are like uh, historical figures just mentioned, but I have no idea who they are. Hey, you see that old lady there? That's Rogue. Best fixer in all the Night City. Thought Dex was the best. <laughs> Rogue was lining up jobs when Dex was still shitting in diapers. <laughs> Place belongs to her. What can I get you? You order. Two tequila old fashions with a splash of cerveza and a chili garnish. <laughs> Duo of Johnny Silverhands coming up. Right on, Chica. Somebody did their homework. Looks like the dog ate mine. Age old tradition. Drinks are named after our regulars. Say I wanted a drink named after me. What would I have to do? Snuff it. Mind blowingly spectacular fashion. Mid up would be best. <sighs> what a beautiful tradition.
Guess dying's a small price to pay for going down in history. I live like a legend first, though, huh? Death. It's nothing but the final flourish. Tonight's city. And the afterlife! Ha <laughs> ha! I honestly didn't know what to pick there. Oh, and by the way, name's Jackie Wells. You want to write down my recipe? Hmm, sure. Shot of vodka on the rocks, lime juice, Wobbly. ginger beer. Oh, and most importantly, a splash of love. <laughs> <laughs> I'll remember that. Heard you were Dex's latest finds. Just biz, no big deal. Mr. Deshaun, see you now. Dex a regular. You come here a lot. Had a sort of long hiatus, matter of fact. Didn't show his face for nearly two years. The Tomcat's gotta walk his own path, right? Yeah, well, wherever he walked, he knocked a few pounds off. Guess they weren't delivering that pizza I mentioned before. Break a leg. Thanks. This way. Follow Dex's bodyguard. Oh, she got gold arms too. Cool. Damn, Holmes. You're huge. Work out? Mm. Same here. No, in the ring. Mm. Do some kind of exotic shit. Huh? Kempo? Ninjutsu? <laughs> Bro, I gotta say, he's 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 like my me. highlight of this Drop game. Me. He's a hilarious character, man. Este pinche tipo. That's right, Excelsior. Cold hard eddies, as per usual. Gotta bounce. Well, if it ain't Mr. V. Whole family in one jump place. On top of the... ah, finally! First time in real space. And the flathead. Let's see this bad boy. He just jumped on top of the seat. For no reason. <laughs> Alright then. Set your butts down comfy. Sweet booth. Is soundproof? Jackie. Now, now. Mr. Wells is right. We're gonna be going over some sensitive material. But if it's alright with y'all, I'd like to start with a question for Mr. V. Evelyn Parker, how'd you fare? Well, as I could have, I guess. Walked around Compeki Plaza inside from that raw BD she scrolled. Mm hmm. Bug already filled me in. So you know the target? Yorinobu Arisaka, the Emperor's son and heir apparent. Mm hmm. Man with the millionaire name and no talent to back it up. Evelyn Parker's special friend? So she just want to see what's good, or was there something else? Think she just wanted to see what I was about. Wanted to see what she was about, huh? How about we go over the plan? What you got for us, Dex? This. Well, here goes nothing. Me and Dex have already covered the fine deeds. Ops-wise, should be a stroll on the beach. Elaborate. I want to hear it. A Delamain will drop your asses at the front door of Kentucky Plaza. You'll stroll right in thanks to your false identities. Then, with Bug's help, you'll breach the hotel subnet. Mine and the Flathead's help. Last but not least, you slip into Yorinobu's penthouse and clep the relic. Goes without saying, we do this on the hush. Ideally, no bodies. Not a one. You'll have T-Bug on comms for the duration. Time for your burning questions. Transports at Delamain. Primus Gap Company in All Night City. Not a mall. Deshaun don't ever work with anyone but the best. I consider Delamain just that. 
Yeah, who needs creepy, nosy cab drivers when you've got a clean AI to get you from point A to B in style? And how he bags a permit to operate every year is still a mystery. If everything goes as planned, Delamain will drop you back here. If things get sticky, you head for the safe house. Which is? The no-tell motel. Quiet, no questions asked. Make our next move from there. But I'm flat certain that won't be necessary. Anything else? These new identities. Tell us more. What's our cover? Hello, Ramon Victorino. And you're Harry Conwell. Ramon? Yeah, okay. What do we say we're there for? Biz as usual. Corpo arms deal. In case anyone asks, you there for a bogus meeting with our Osaka's defense rep, Hajime Taki. Anything else? I could be watching. Now, as that old Greek dog says, life's a banquet. So don't go thirsty, but don't get drunk either. Your chariot awaits outside. My cue to Delta Two. Got a prep to jack in. Be there when you come on comms. Any other issues? Now's your chance. You and Dex know each other a while. Um, why? Uh, you know, peeps say all kinds of things. Everything we hear is an opinion, not a fact. Marcus Aurelius, I think. <laughs> You and Dex both philosophizing. No wonder you get along. I'm good, no questions. Let's get to work. So you ready to get going or what? Let's roll, no point in waiting. In getting rich, you mean? Hi, Stone.